Hi, this video tutorial is for this look that I'm wearing right now. A lot of green and blue eyeshadow, um, black lip uh, with a like a pigment that it's actually like a grain. So my li you'll see it in the pictures. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna post them before or after the video, but um, here's a look I came up with. Just screwing around with my makeup. Would probably be a good look for Halloween or whatnot. So I hope you like it and please keep watching to find out how to do this. Gotta love this fail lighting right now. So anyway, um, I already applied my foundation and I'm going to grab my eyeshadow primer. The eyeshadow primer that I'm using is going to be Prime Time from Bare Essentials. The first thing you want to do is your eyebrows. I'm using a MAC black eyeliner. And this is how we're going to draw on the eyebrows. A little, a little Susie-esque, but... I'm going to start from the, about the middle between my eyebrow and where my tear duct area meet. And go straight up. Try to get that as even as possible. Like that. And starting from the bottom of that line, you're going to go straight up. Like that. If you screw up, just go like I did right there. Just go back and fix it. Since that eyeliner I used from Mac smears, I'm going to take an angled brush, like a Mac 266, and I'm going to uh, color in that line. So it's even and perfect as possible. So I elongated that eyeliner just a tad bit more because this eyeliner is just a pain in the freaking ass to work with. So looks like that, like a crazy chola eyebrow. After you have the brows fairly even, go ahead and take that angled brush that you use to uh, shade in the brows and take a black eyeshadow. I'm using MAC Carbon. It's the black one, by the way, not the white one that I have my finger on. And just set that eyeliner. Alright, the shadow I'm taking um, on my lid up into the crease will be Shimmer Moss for MAC. The color right there. I'm going to apply that color with a uh, Bare Essentials blending brush. And when you apply it, you're going to apply it up into where that um, black ends. Now right above that color Shimmer Moss, I'm going to apply Climate Blue for MAC. It was a limited edition color. It's like a pur it's kind of like a purple, uh, a royal blue. So purple blue with a little bit of pink shimmer. I'm going to apply that with the MAC 213. And just pat that on. For the highlight color, I'm using Gesso from MAC. It's a matte white. And I'm going to apply that with the MAC 217. So 
Underneath the lash line, I'm applying a, let me see, this is the uh, Shade Stick in Silver Blue. It's pretty old, so. For the bottom lash line, we're going to make like a reverse wing. Uh, I'm going to do that with a black pencil. This is Black Ebony from Lancome. And I'll show you what I mean. So right on the edge, right here of your eye, you're just going to go straight down. And after you do that, the tip of the wing that you make, you're going to go right back up. Just a little bit. Line your waterline with a reddish color. I'm using MAC. Um, this is, if the camera's gonna pick that up. This color is in Foxy Lady. Line your upper lash line. I'm using Super Slick Liquid Eyeliner from MAC just in a black color. All right, so I got my lashes and mascara on. Can you see that? They're kind of drying right now, so. Okay, we're gonna apply blush and um, I'm doing a makeup tutorial after this, so I'm not going to apply what I would normally apply for this look, but um, I would use like a gray, you want to use a very sharp line, you want to look kind of dead, I guess, whatever. Um, I would use a gray uh, to contour and make kind of like a, uh, kind of hollow out the cheeks, the color buff for MAC. And I'm going to apply that with the MAC 136. I'm lining my lips in Burgundy Lip Pencil for MAC. The way I'm lining the lower lip is um, slightly smaller than my natural lip line. To make kind of like a, a doll shape or like a 1920s like Clara Bow um, lip. I'm lining my lips in MAC lipstick. This is the... Um, Mad Teen Lipstick called Midnight Medium. It came out with the Style Black collection a while back. All right, you may need to clean up that li uh, the lipstick you applied, so just take some concealer around your lip to perfect that. All right, the next thing I'm going to do is apply a MAC pigment on top of that black lipstick. This is Deep Blue Green from MAC Cosmetics. I have to be able to see that. It's a really gorgeous color. I recommend buying this. You're going to take a little bit off of that lid and just apply it to your lips. So this is the finished look. Um, you can see that. So it's kind of like a um, evil villain gothic mermaid look. What's it called? That sounds horrible. But um, here it is. And... If you try this look out, uh, just send me a video response because I would love to see it if anybody actually wanted to do this to themselves. Alright, so thank you for watching and I have a few more um, video ideas. So, see if I can do one of those tonight. Alright, thank you. Bye.